Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Veronica. For today's video, we have a Bath and Body Works haul. But before we get into it, make sure you guys like this video, make sure you subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you're aware of all future videos. All right guys, so it's been a while since I bought any Bath and Body Works products, specifically candles. It's been crazy. Honestly, since I had initially joined Sensi, which was in 2020, October 2020, yeah. Um, I stopped buying candles and I had two candles, which was, what was it? Summer Boardwalk and the Blueberry Pancakes. Blueberry pancakes? Yes, those two. I had those two candles from basically before I got involved with Scentsy or before I even got involved, let's just say with wax melts in general, because before October 2020, I never used wax melts. I know my mom did. Um, I guess when Scentsy was like introduced into Canada, she was buying wax melts. I was really, really young. Um, and uh, yeah, I know that she used wax melts, but I didn't really know about it like that until basically the pandemic hit. And I'm like, wait, I can't smell any more Bath & Body Works candles. So how am I supposed to get any kind of scent? And then I remember this whole Scentsy thing with my mom and I'm like, let me look into it. And then that's basically where my whole wax melt journey started. So um, since then, I just haven't bought any candles. Oh, and before we get into the candles, I just wanted to show you guys, I just did my nails. I have my moments where like I don't do my nails at all and then I have my like moments where I just do them every single week so these are my own nails uh, it's the shaping for me that takes a while but I did like a baby pink with a little bit of a shimmer but I'm just I'm very very lucky that I don't need to use any falsies I used to use them all the time in high school and realized how much they like damaged my nails because of how often I did it and I'm like, girl, your nails grow so quickly. Why don't you just use your own? So anyways, I've just done it for the last seven years. I've been doing it on my own. I haven't gone to the salon, uh, to the nail salon unless it's for like a special occasion and I really want my nails to be super like perfect or I need some kind of like gel on it, like a thick gel. What is it? Acrylic? Not acrylic, but the gel overlay. Gel overlay is what I prefer to do if I'm doing something like special. Um, but okay, let's get into the candles because that's not what you guys are here. I just, you know, wanted to show them off. So the first candle I got is Fiji White Sands. And this entire collection, by the way, I love just the packaging itself. It's super neutral, very clean. Um, I went with a girlfriend of mine and she said that the entire line kind of gave her like Kim Kardashian vibes. And um, she's right. She's right. It does give Kim K vibes just because of the neutral colors. But anyway, so this one is Fiji White Sands with notes of fresh cut sugar cane, white nectarine, and sandalwood. This to me is a summer set. It is so beautiful. You get the sugar cane, you get the nectarine. I'm a huge lover in the summertime when it comes to fruits, nectarine, and peaches. Oh my God so so freaking good you get the sandalwood it's really really cozy and warm but it's not too warm i love this one it's definitely the perfect like beach scent for me without that coconut vibe and like sun sun sunscreen sunscreen or tanning lotion whichever one they like to use in oils oh this is just so pretty it's a little bit lighter but i don't mind it Hopefully it performs. I'm really excited to burn this candle. Next up we have Pink Lavender and Espresso from the same line as the, uh, the previous candle I showed you guys. So it takes a lot for me to like a scent with any kind of coffee, coffee, espresso, latte, whatever it is. It takes a lot because I just, I guess because like I'm making coffee in the morning or whatever it is. I already have that smell lingering for a while. So to me, that's already like my scent, you know? And then it, you know, disappears and I can warm something else. I don't want my place to smell like coffee all day. So they need to do it right. Like this, the oil, the scent, it just needs to be done properly when it comes to that. And this is perfect. It's different. It's unique. So this has notes of rich pink lavender, caramel, espresso beans, and smooth vanilla. And I think it's, it's the combination of the lavender with the espresso beans, but then the, the vanilla tones it down. It's a very smooth vanilla. 
and it's like you know there's espresso there but it's almost like it's not there but it is it's like sometimes when I smell it I get more of the lavender and vanilla alone but then other times I get the lavender with the espresso or sometimes I get the espresso and the, I don't know it's very it's a very tricky scent for me when I'm smelling it like it definitely changes all the time but I love it it's so pretty I think this will be a really really good performer I'm hoping it gives me enough throw I think it will it smells medium on cold oh I love this one so much and again guys the aesthetics it's just so beautiful I love this oh my god okay and then the last candle which kind of goes with my shirt with the little bananas so cute um, is and I know this one's been the talk of the town is Main Street Bakery how cute is this candle I love the designs on it okay so this one has I think the notes are at the bottom yep so fresh banana vanilla wafers and cinnamon sugar <sighs> I love me a good banana scent y'all and this is that this is the shit okay this is that banana scent and it's not to me I'm not really getting a fake banana I'm getting closer to an authentic banana Oh, this one's so pretty. Ugh, this is so freaking good. And then you get the wafers. I'm not really picking up too much on the cinnamon. I'm glad that it's, I'm pretty sure, did I say cinnamon sugar? Yeah, cinnamon sugar. You can tell because it's not that like, I just tossed a bunch of cinnamon on top of the banana. It's so freaking delicious. Mmm, this is a really good bakery. I'm surprised I didn't buy more bakery, but I was like self-control. Right now, I'm all about when it comes to candles, when it comes to anything, skincare especially, because whew, I used to go crazy with skincare, but I'm just trying to be mindful of what I have um, and finishing the product products that I have before buying more. Um, these days are very, very difficult, um, especially, well, depending really on what city you live in things can be very expensive and if you guys don't know I live in Toronto and Toronto is such an expensive city like right Canada if you live in Ontario specifically Toronto or in um, in Vancouver BC it's expensive and then I know there's a few states um, that are very I know San Francisco is definitely very very expensive new york I, I don't even know what other places so it's like whenever you know i'm i go like i'm scrolling on instagram and they're showing these like big beautiful houses like specifically texas there's these big beautiful homes that are just oh they're just they're to die for honestly they're so beautiful but the prices are crazy and then when you compare the house like i'm not even gonna say a house it's like a mansion in texas compared to something in Toronto, it's night and day. You're literally paying the same price for a mansion in Texas as you would be for a, co a condo is probably even more expensive than a mansion in Texas. It's actually insane. So me, bring, me bringing that up, it's just to say, you know, times are hard and you know, you just got to be really mindful of like what you're buying and making sure that you're not just hoarding things. And I used to be really bad on that, especially with my skincare, um, which I should probably do a video and show you guys because I've gotten really into skincare since the pandemic specifically. Um, and okay, that's for, that's another video. Anyways, I'm going to shut up about that. But yeah, just being mindful of what I have is the goal and not overspending and not hoarding things so yeah anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video as always make sure you guys like comment and subscribe to all my social media platforms which i will link down below and if you guys have not shopped any of my wax melts check out meltingmemories.ca and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys